What up, it's your boy NWP, and today we're gonna show you how to unlock Seraph in Blackout. Which, you know, actually comes with all the other customizations for specialists that you have unlocked from the black market. But before we do that, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, take the time right now to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell just next to it so that you can get alerted anytime that I drop a new video. If you like this video at any time, hit the thumbs up, and if you have any comments, suggestions, or feedback, drop them in the box below. Additionally, I'm running giveaways. Check the links in the description. It's going to be for $50 in your favorite gaming currency, and we're just going to bring that up right now, whether it be $50 in Steam, $50 in PlayStation, or $50 in Xbox. It's all up to you, but you got to be subscribed to win so check the links in the description all right let's get to it now how do you unlock seraph in blackout well the first thing you need to do is unlock is well get an annihilator okay so here's the things you need to do after you have an annihilator which is get a kill place top five and still have it in your inventory so first thing is how do you get an annihilator well you're gonna have to go to firing range right there where i just showed you on the map and you're gonna come in here all right you're gonna land in uh, where i was uh, where it's marked you're gonna get a gun as fast as you can and kill everybody else that's in here because there's gonna be people trying to do the same thing you're doing i don't almost promise you that all right so after i clean this guy up here real quick we'll go ahead and pick up a, well there already should be typically there is already a mose in here if there's not a mose in here then you're pretty much screwed but after you get a hold of a mose there's going to be six targets down range okay all six need to be hit after you hit all six, that red box will be open and will have an annihilator in it. Okay, so all six of these, including these little white ones that I shot again here for no reason. But yeah, boom, in the box, annihilator, bam. All right, next step, we're going to have to get a kill with the annihilator. So here we go. Oh, oh, there we got a guy up here. And oh, one hit, nope, two hits. It's a two-hit kill without shields, so there you go. Now you know. Then you're going to camp because you got to place top five. Put a little chicken on the ground there. Teabag it. Yeah. Okay. So now close your doors, camp it up because, listen, you need to camp. I don't care what anybody tells you. I mean, you can go for it, if you. but if you really want to unlock this, you're going to have to camp to get top five. And, uh, you know, how aggressive you are as a player beyond that is up to you. But really, uh, I suggest you camp. And, uh, yeah, as you can see here, I literally just stopped and was listening to everything for a good chunk of time. So we'll go ahead and just do the magic of television. We'll warp to the next time. And you, this is how I did it. We were going to just ride the ring out like the hell with it. At least I'll know where everybody is. Stay just on the edge ring the entire time. Like, I promise you this is going to be the best way to do this. Because this was one of the... Um, few uh, maybe not a few but one of the uh you know controllable um unlocks whereas like you know getting a rocket launch or a grenade launcher in the drops is just not gonna you know 100 percent gonna happen so you know or finding poker chips or you know like the the little like coins and stuff like that so like really this one is one you can control and just outskill so as you see here i'm just running with the gas pretty much just getting plowed by the gas right now and just using my meds to survive um really just want to place the top five you know what i mean just really you want to get that top five placement so that you can go and unlock your character and uh yeah that's this is how this is how i did it right here i ran through the gas like a little ass like you know just a cheap <laughs> is i played as cheap as i could and um yeah, I actually got a win off this one, so that's pretty cool. But uh, I think I've gone over all the steps right now, guys. Um, you need to place top five. You need to get a kill with the Annihilator. And you need to get an Annihilator. Getting the Annihilator is probably... Mm, I'd say that's probably going to be the most challenging part, with, depending on the amount of people that are going to be at the area. But this is you know probably one of the cooler uh blackout you know specialists because at least you know you look cool instead of looking like you know some kind of mountain man or like some kind of weird dr seuss character i don't know you know, you know what i'm saying guys like you just these characters all look goofy and uh yeah i mean this was um you know unexpected right here i um was like oh okay Let's do this then. Let's try and make a video. And it ended up working out pretty well. Now, I hid in this bathroom for a, 
a good chunk of time. I mean, for real. I was like, screw this shit. I want this... I want this damn Annihilator uh, unlock for Seraph so I can play it. Stop playing as, you know, goofy characters when I play. So, again, we'll go in. As you can see, you know, just crunching time here. Just torching the time to get to, you know, the top five. And I'm still getting kills is the, is the worst part. It's like I'm still going through and getting kills. And it's just, you know, after I get to, you know, number five, I'm like, all right, screw it. Let's do this. And, uh, you know just really like the most obvious things here like on how to win so yeah guys if you want to watch the rest of the video watch the rest of the video thanks for watching thanks for subscribing and as always have a good one